darlings, Beatrice message your service. Today, yes, Beatrice messes bathing relax. Oh, some of you love to take showers and I'm so happy for you, darling. But it is essential to know when you get inside the hot bath that it soothes the muscles, it relaxes them, and makes the body feel right as rain, dear. This is what you'll need about 24 ounces of water, very chilled with BM's nice lemon detox in it, darling, and put a bit of that wonderful local honey. You'll need some sea salt, about half a cup, darling. You'll need baking soda, one cup. You'll need one cup of apple cider vinegar. That's right, dear. Soothing, relaxing. And you will need about 20 to 23 drops of lavender oil in your bath. That's right, darling. It's wonderful for the skin. It's a fabulous aromatherapy in the nose, breathing in and out in that aromatherapy. Now, in the hot bath, a lot of us do not like hot baths, me included, darling. But I must essentially stress to you, my dears, that the hot bath relaxes the muscles when you are sore and you are hurting in your body, like I am right now. So I want to soothe my body. I drew a nice hot bath. And sometimes it gets a little bit too much, so I have to get out for a little bit and then come back in. But essentially, you want to stay in the hot bath for 20 to 30 minutes. That's right. If you can't make it to the 30 minutes, we understand, but you at least need, you at least need to make it for that 20 minutes, darling. You have your third eye meditation pillow right here, which is wonderful, dear. <laughs> you can purchase it down below, free shipping. Oh, darling, it's wonderful. Just relax in your hot bath. You have a nice pillow right here. Oh, this is wonderful, dear. I just love my hot aroma, aromatherapy baths. Oh, yes, BM's relaxing bath. Yeah, and you're going to want to take your third eye meditation pillow. I put a little bit of a candle. It's a lovely scent, darling. You put your third eye meditation pillow over your eyes. Oh, yes. And for me, I'm opening up my knees nice and wide. As wide as you can in your bathtub. Just relaxing. You want to go all the way up to the shoulders, darling, because you want to get that neck that sensation of the hot water seeping into the tight muscles in your neck and shoulders. And we're going to do a little bit of breathing, dear, like my cousin Athena does in her yoga videos. That's right. That nice, deep breathing in and out through the nose. And we do that because, well, I guess she says it does a body good, so we might as well do it. Breathe in through the nose with the mouth closed. Inhale. And exhale. Relax. Ooh, this feels marvelous, dear. Mia never goes anywhere without her white coat, including the bath. Yes. So you might think she is a bit extreme, but darling, there is a purpose. The craziness inside my mind, yes, that's what it is, dear, the craziness. After all, BM does stand for bowel movement, and I do view my career as a colon optimist. Yes, it is a fake, made-up name, but darling, the truest of true forms, we teach you certain ways to relax the body, to have a good pool every day with the lemon and ginger water, with local honey, ooh, a 
natural Gatorade, darling. Now, VM's getting a bit very hot. Like we said, sometimes it's tough to stay through the full 20 minutes. But you're going to do this with me, dear. Take that water bottle that you have close by that's filled with ice and lemon and start drinking it. That's right. What this does, darling, is it replenishes your electrolytes. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh, we're going to put some... Oh, is this fabulous? Put in the hands in the water. Oh, and seeping into the tight. And as you feel in your joints. Oh, my goodness, dear. What a fabulous thing that is. So let's go over the muscles that we're relaxing right now, darling. Relax your shoulders, which are the deltoid muscles. Relax your biceps and the top part of your arm. Relax the triceps and the bottom part of your arm. Relax the forearms. Ooh, yes, dear. Ooh, that feels marvelous, darling. Absolutely marvelous. When you feel marvelous in the body, dear, you feel marvelous all around. And you're able to bounce back energetically happily. Yes. Breathe in. Breathe out. If you have to get out for a breather, go ahead and do that. This is very hot. And we're feeling that we might need a little breathing. So we're going to sit up. Oh my goodness dear. Yes, just for a little bit. This does not count in the 20 minute break. BM is going to do a forward bend in the bathtub. Yes, she is. Take the hands, place them on top of the shins. Bring the chin into the chest. Slowly lower. This essentially helps open up the large colon, which help you poo easy as well, because sometimes when our lower lumbar sacral bone area is tight, we feel that discomfort, let's say, darling. We feel that discomfort, that discomfort tightens up our belly. When it tightens up our belly, we don't pull, darling. So sometimes we have to generate that fabulous release. And BM's Beat Boost that we shared with you a couple of weeks ago, go to that video, dear, either on YouTube or Facebook. That beet boost cleans the colon out nice and right and wonderful. Breathe in. Breathe out. Allow the body to relax forward. So we're taking a breath break and a forward bend because sometimes the 20 minutes in the bathtub all the way in is too much for the body, especially if we tend to get hot flashes like BM does. But we are a holistic healing channel, dear. That's right. S-I-F-S-G production stands for smile. It feels so good. And darling, each thing that we teach you feels so good. You're going to want to gobble us up every week. Can't wait for the next video. You're going to love us, love us, love us. Relax in your forward bend. Because our five minute break is almost up. Then we'll have to, oh my goodness, get down into the water again. Which sometimes is too much for me, yes. But I'm going to not force myself, but... Let's not use that word. Let's use the word as relax into it. When we relax into it, our mind is opened up to helping our body. Slowly come up on the next inhale. Ooh, this crackiness in the neck is going to dissipate, darling. Slowly lower back. Now, when you come up, as I did, I feel a little bit of wobbliness in the head. And that is natural, especially when you're in a hot bath. 
What you want to do is you want to hydrate another 10 gulps. Ready, go. Okay. Relax the arms, relax the head, put back on the third eye meditation pill if you already haven't, if you haven't already. Feel the relaxation of the third eye meditation pill come over the body. You could take our glasses off. That would be probably a good thing. Yes, you have to take the glasses off when you do the aromatherapy eye pillow. And with the soothing, relaxing Nature Healing Society music in the background. Oh, this is wonderful. I believe Cousin Athena is going to teach you a wonderful yogic restorative opening after this because when you're in a restorative pose when you relax and you open up after you've gotten out of a warm hot bath it opens up your body even more through the deep breaths that she teaches us oh it's so wonderful dear <laughs> breathe in and breathe out. I think she does it on a count of three. Let's fill up the body now, darling. Breathe in one, two, three. Breathe out three, two, one. <clears throat> Feel it seep into your bones, dear. You feel it seep into your body. All right, darling, darlings, come up for just a moment. Let's do a recap of how these wonderful, essential ingredients in this BM's Bat Relax helps your body. Baking soda removes the toxins in our skin, dear. We sweat when we're in a hot bath, and when that happens, it seeps through our pores and we're getting rid of all the yucky stuff inside of our body, darling. Yes, our largest organ in our body is the skin. And when we detox the skin, we feel a little bit better when we get all that nastiness off of it. Even though we take a shower and we scrub our body good every day, baking soda in a hot bath just helps rid the body. It is a key ingredient. Apple cider vinegar moisturizes the skin. Isn't that lovely? <laughs> oh, yes. It also increases the digestion system. And what do we do when we teach BM's Monday morning power habits, dear? Yes, we teach increase in digestion is essential for a good poo. <laughs> what a wonderful thing this is, darling. Yes. It also helps with body odor. So if you're having issues with body odor, and even though you're using those wonderful underarm deodorants and you're spraying yourself with body spray, this helps detoxify that skin, getting rid of the body odor. But you have to do this three times a week, darling. That's right. You're stressed to the max. You want to release that stress. BM's bath, relax three times a week. <laughs> You will thank me, dear. You will send me notes and say, Oh, BM, I'm so grateful. <laughs> and BM does love positive reinforcement. Thank you. <laughs> sea salt. It stimulates the circulation in the body. When you stimulate circulation, what happens, darling? You are able to heal yourself much easier. The stimulation of circulations, the sea salt adds the magnesium and potassium minerals to your body. When that happens, darling, you heal faster. So 
say you have an injury, or say you feel sick three times a week or more every day if you definitely are injury or sick to help heal your body faster, right? But of course, dear. <laughs> Lavender. Now, this is the tricky part. If we have sensitive skin, if you have sensitive skin, darling, you want to stay away from the lavender. Yes, I am so sorry, dear. Even though it does heal insomnia, it does help relax and get rid of headaches and soothe your mind for a nice restful bath. Excuse me, a nice restful sleep. Good night. Essential oils, some of us have to be careful with because we have sensitive skin. However, on the opposite side of that, if we do have any skin lacerations, if we do have any skin irritations, the combination of all of these is going to help heal that skin laceration, that opening, that itchy sensation through bugs. So much easier, dear. Yes. So we have about five more minutes, right? Let's go ahead, put our third eye meditation pillow on, and spend the five minutes just listening to the music, relaxing with the body, mind, and spirit, because you're gonna follow along with this video. You're learning essential tools to help your body feel great. Yes, dear. Just take those deep breaths, inhale, one, Two, three, expanding your chest, opening up those lungs, darling. Exhale, three, two, one. Get rid of the strain in your brain. Bring that grin to your face, darling. That's it. Calm. Quiet. Relax your limbs, relax your joints. Feel the breath healing in your body. Feel the breath healing your mind. Yes, the breath heals our mind, darlings. Nice big grin on the inhale. Nice relaxing jaw on the exhale. Separate the jaw, dears. Keeping the mouth closed. Swallow here. Relax the throat, the hands. We sell our third eye meditation pillow right down below through the link, dear. You're gonna love that one. Free shipping. We share with you BM's Monday morning power habits each Monday. We thank you for your likes, your shares. We thank you so much for giving us a thumbs up. But most of all, we thank you for your subscriptions. Yes, dear, that's how we're able to bring you positive feedback each and every week. Breathe in, slowly come up, take up your third eye meditation pillow, make sure it does not fall into the water. This is not good, the third eye meditation pillow, because it has to be replaced after that. Or you can dry it out. Thank you for joining me for BM's Bath Relax. Until next week, dears. <laughs>